you got a call from an Auburn booster who said, Chuck, I need 100 grand to get to some AU coach to give to some kid so he'll come to Auburn. Totally against the rules. If it ever got out, it would be a disaster. Yeah. But, but we need the money. Would you do it? Sure, I would do it. If, if, if my college asked me for money to help recruit a player. Yeah, Even if course. it's against the rules. It, man, the rules are so unfair. Uh, listen, I have zero. So let me tell you something. I, have, I don't have a lot of respect for the NCAA. And, and this hurts me to say this right now. Because it's personally uh, about Kenny and Roy Williams, two people I really like. But the notion that they would get mad at me giving a kid cash. And North Carolina has been letting kids not go to class for many, many years. And let's get one thing, they're not the only one who, who they just got caught. The notion that they would get mad at me for helping uh, recruit a kid instead of really worried about these kids getting an education, you think I'm going to respect them? You think about that. They're not putting the hammer down on North Carolina. I mean, think about that. What are those kids going to do when they grow up? They got, they, they're uneducated and we, we made a lot of money on these kids. And the notion that they tell me helping my school get better is not worse than kids going, not going to class. They're putting young men who have played basketball and football who are not going on to the next level, I might add. They put them in society uneducated. What do you think is worse? So, and you, you want me to have respect for that system? I got no respect for that system. Don't miss Seth's interview with Basketball Hall of Famer Charles Barkley only on Campus Insiders.